It's been over two years in the making, but finally, movie producer Kerry Missler is ready to release his film, which uncovers a hidden Canadian pastime. What I love about surfing in Canada is that it's not easy. It's challenging. I mean, a lot of people didn't know that you could surf in Canada. Missler highlights the best this country has to offer from Tofino to Nova Scotia to right here at home, where surfing becomes a whole new ball game on Okanagan Lake. I was driving home about five years ago from a Soyuz and it was just a really stormy, cloudy day and uh, windy. And I thought to myself, wow, it looks like there could be people, it could be big enough to surf out there. And then I drove around the, the corner to Antlers Beach and sure enough, there was a guy out there surfing. I started surfing Antlers, I guess it'd be about five years ago. I started surfing Antlers probably five years ago. I started surfing Antlers Beach maybe six years ago. So in the dead of winter, Missler joins the ranks of the hardcore to uncover a surfing gem. It's actually almost twice as cold when you're surfing on the lake in the wintertime just because you're dealing with harsh conditions, ice, snow, rain, wind. Pretty much all the conditions are cold, colder and like even colder. Like I mean, it's cold. So I, I really like that experience. It was my favorite part was filming the sections in uh, Peachland, British Columbia. Yet Antlers Beach isn't the only spot to hit a wave in the Okanagan. Wake surfing is also taking off and Missler tracks down some of the area's finest to get the up and up on how it's done. Yeah, my son and I have been wake surfing for about 10 years. We're actually one of the first groups here to start doing it in the Okanagan and uh, now everybody's doing it and probably about 75% of the people on the lake are wake surfing now. It's very low impact. Anybody can do it, even us old guys. It's a different way to do it. Obviously, it's not the same as the ocean, but you have an endless wave so you can keep going forever and uh, this is overall good socially, a good time. You're out on the lake, you got a whole boatload of people that are cheering you on right there and uh, you got the endless wave. And behind the scenes of that good time is a growing bond within the surfing community. And Missler manages to capture it all. I mean, hands down, it's the guys you meet in the water. I would, I would definitely say is, is the brotherhood that I think is forming. It's just the people you're with. It's the people you're with, any, any surfer knows. Yeah, that's been the, the fun thing about being hooked up with Carrie, is we're meeting all sorts of different people. A lot of the people that are in the movie that are surfing on Long Beach and uh, the paddleboard, and they've come out in our boat, and they can't believe the wave that we have, and they can actually surf right away. So instead of paddling all the way out, falling down, we can just jump out, and you can surf literally the whole length of the lake. The Great Canadian Surfer movie premieres at the Kelowna Community Theatre, August 22nd, where doors open at 6.30. Jen Zielinski in Kelowna for Castanet News.